Hello, how are you all? Welcome to my channel, Sangrila with Ila Anand Acharya. And I am really, very happy, really, very excited, and really, really thankful to all those who are watching my videos, liking it, commenting on it, and sharing it, and subscribing to my channel. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you so much. So today, I am going to share with you some detail regarding the fifth phrase of Ho O Pono Pono Priya. Yes, I'm very very happy that uh, on the simple sentence which I have given to you as a fifth phrase of Ho Pono Pono, the views are amazing on that video. And in that video, I have only shared the fifth phrase of Ho Pono Pono Prayer, which is I forgives myself. So now when I am repeating every day my Ho Pono Pono four phrases, I add to that the swift phrases. That is basic Ho Pono Pono prayer is I love you, I'm sorry, please forgive me, thank you. Fifth phrase now, I forgives myself. So I forgives myself is the fifth phrase I have shared with you and then I told you that I'll bring the detailed video. So this is the one. So uh, here, this has the fifth phrase has come as an inspiration to Dr. Joe Vitali, who has uh, you know that yes, Dr. Joe Vitali, who has written this book Zero Limits uh, along with Dr. Hulen E. Haliakala, and uh, Dr. Hulen was the mentor of Dr. Joe Vitali from whom. Joe Vitali has known about Hoponopono prayer and then he has written this book and shared about it among the whole world. Now, once he has completed this book, writing about this book, he has also written one more book. In fact, two more books. One is Add Zero and third book is the title, the fifth phrase of Hoponopono prayer. So, uh, after referring uh, to the and researching about this I came to know that Dr. Joe Vitali got an inspiration to frame this sentence as the fifth phrase of Ho'oponopono prayer where it says grammatically it is not con correct he says uh, in his audios and in his videos that grammatically the fifth phrase is not up to the mark like I forgives myself so here he is sharing that I is the divinity is the divine God or it is the Paramatma to whom we all belong to from where we have come so I is the void according to Dr. Joe Vitali or the divinity the divine the zero limits or at zero where there is nothing so that is I okay and forgives means the Paramatma the divinity the divine forgives myself my means the part of him which is there inside me so the entire whole divinity is forgiving the little self the myself which has carrying all the memories which has carrying all the data which is carrying all the programming and because of it we are have suffering through all these problems so it says that i forgives myself that means divinity is forgiving the things which are in me the things which are causing the problem the inner child the subconscious mind which is suffering which is having the memories which due to which we are uh, you know in our day-to-day -day life and because of without any reason also we have we are uh, in surrounding with certain things which we don't like so when we are adding this thing it is really giving us the complete package of that four phrases that is i love you which we are again saying to the divinity to Paramatma that I love you I am sorry we are asking for the uh, forgiveness that I am sorry please forgive me what is there in me which is causing this problem 
okay so then thank you and when we say that this is from our side we are saying that i love you i'm sorry please forgive me thank you this is we are saying to the divinity now divinity is answering to us that i forgives myself myself is my inner part my smaller part which has all these problems the subconscious mind so it is forgiving us and we are feeling okay really 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 the meaning of this is now complete because we are being forgiven so this is the real meaning of fifth phrase that is the divinity is forgiving us and we are really now going towards at zero we are going towards zero frequency as mentioned by mabel ketz where mabel ketz is again the uh, student of dr hulen she uh, was working with dr hulen since very long time and she is you know basically giving the speeches in spanish and english and all the other languages so she uh, consider at zero as zero frequency so she has written all the books based on hoponopono as at zero frequency uh, based on the zero frequency concept so i hope you understand the uh, the real meaning of the fifth phrase if you have still any doubt please comment below this video and i know that you want to know more about hoponopono so stay tuned i am going to bring more about it in my upcoming videos lot 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 i am researching day by day about hoponopono and thank you thank you thank you thank you so much bye